Imagine a room where the air hums with anticipation, where screens flicker with the heartbeat of the universe itself. On July 3rd, 2025, the Atlas Control Room at CERN was exactly that, a nerve center of particle physics where the ordinary became extraordinary in a single, electrifying moment. At 227 UTC, a collision inside the massive Atlas detector didn't just produce data, it unleashed a mystery. The shift leader, a physicist whose steady hands had guided countless experiments, froze as as her monitor flashed with an alert. A spike, sharp and unyielding, cut through the usual stream of data, three muon tracks, each veering at impossible angles, 17 degrees, 43 degrees, and a near vertical 91 degrees, paired with a missing energy gap of 1.8 tera electron volts. This wasn't a blip, this was a 7.5 sigma event, a statistical outlier so rare that the odds of it happening by chance were less than one in 300 trillion. To put that in perspective, it's like flipping a coin and getting heads 50 times in a row, then doing it again and again and again. The room's hum turned to a buzz of urgency as the team scrambled to verify what they were seeing. Was this a glitch, a cosmic ray, or something far stranger? The shift leader's voice, usually calm, carried a tremor as she initiated the red banner protocol, locking down the event buffer to preserve every fragment of data. Monitors across the room mirrored the warning. Statistical outlier, 7.5 sigma, immediate triage required. The team, a mix of seasoned veterans and wide-eyed newcomers, stared at the angular patterns of reconstructed tracks, their minds racing to make sense of the impossible. The missing energy vector, angled 36 degrees above the beam line, sliced through the detector's core like a blade. The event's digital fingerprint was unlike anything in the standard model, the framework that has defined particle physics for decades. No known particle, no predicted resonance, just a void where answers should have been. As the night crew from Data Quality rushed in, lab coats half-buttoned, the realization settled over the room. This wasn't just a record-breaking moment, it was a challenge to everything they thought they knew. In the world of particle physics, a 7.5 sigma deviation isn't just a number, it's a seismic shift. Most discoveries are announced at 5 sigma, a threshold where the chance of a fluke is less than 1 in 3 million. At 7.5 sigma, the odds plummet to 1 in 300 trillion, a probability so vanishingly small it defies comprehension. Imagine picking a single specific grain of sand from every beach on Earth, blindfolded on the first try. That's the kind of anomaly the ATLAS team was grappling with. The CERN statistics team moved with surgical precision, dissecting every variable. Was it detector noise? Cosmic ray contamination? A timing glitch? One by one, each possibility was tested, simulated, and ruled out. The event's signature, three muons at improbable angles, a missing energy vector, and an invariant mass gap of 1.8 tera electron volts held firm under scrutiny. This wasn't a mistake, it was a message. The standard model, the bedrock of modern physics predicts a universe of order where particles and forces fit neatly into equations. But this event, dubbed the three-eyed anomaly for its triple muon signature, didn't fit. The invariant mass landed in a region the model insists should be empty, a silent zone where no known particle resides. The numbers were unrelenting, pointing to a reality the textbooks couldn't explain. For the physicists in the control room, the question wasn't just what they'd found, it was what it meant. If the standard model couldn't account for this, were were they standing on the precipice of a new era in science? The data wasn't just a puzzle, it was a dare to rethink the universe itself. Across the globe, theorists sprang into action, their whiteboards filling with equations that stretched into the night. At MIT, Dr. Elena Nguyen, a particle physicist known for her relentless curiosity, stared at the event display, her mind racing through first principles. The standard model was a map, but this event was off the grid. Could it be supersymmetry, the elegant theory that proposes a mirror world of particles? Supersymmetry predicts heavy particles decaying in cascades, each step a coin flip with vanishing small odds. But even the most optimistic models fell short, predicting a rate of 1 in 100 trillion, still too rare to explain the Atlas anomaly. Nguyen scrawled the numbers on her whiteboard. Susie, 1 in 10 to the 14th power. The math was brutal and the room grew quiet. If supersymmetry couldn't bridge the gap, what could? At Caltech, another team took a bolder leap, diving into the realm of extra dimensions. In the late 1990s, physicists Lisa Randall and Raman Sundram proposed a radical 
idea. Our universe is a three-dimensional brain floating in a higher dimensional space, like a sheet of paper in an unseen ocean. Gravity, they argued, isn't weak. It's just leaking into dimensions we can't perceive. The Atlas anomaly with its 1.8 teraelectron volt mass gap lined up almost perfectly with predictions for a Kaluza klein graviton, a particle that could carry energy across dimensional boundaries. The missing energy vector, angled 36 degrees above the beam line, matched simulations of gravity escaping our brain, leaving a void in the detector. The Caltech team mapped the event's topology, their excitement tempered by unease. If this was a graviton, it wasn't just a particle. It was proof of a universe far stranger than anyone had imagined. Then there was the dark photon hypothesis, a theory that sent ripples through CERN's joint task force with Fermilab. Dark photons, elusive cousins of the ordinary photon, interact so weakly with normal matter that they slip through detectors like ghosts. The Atlas event matched predictions for a dark photon with a mass of 1.8 tera electron volts and a coupling constant of 10 to the power of negative 3. This wasn't just a particle, it was a gateway to the dark sector, a hidden realm of particles and forces that barely touch our own. The triple muon signature, with its improbable angles, fit simulations where a dark photon decayed invisibly, carrying energy away from the collision. The implications were staggering. A dark photon could rewrite the rules of physics, revealing forces that shape the universe from the shadows. For the task force, the stakes were clear. This wasn't a fluke. It was a glimpse into a reality we're only beginning to understand. The anomaly didn't stop at particle physics. On the same day, July 3, 2025, astronomers tracking a peculiar comet designated C-2025X3 noticed something equally baffling. Its trajectory nearly retrograde and aligned within 5 degrees of the ecliptic defied statistical odds. The probability of such a path, calculated at 0.2%, dropped to a mere 0.005% when factoring in its close passes to Venus, Mars, and Jupiter. The comet its motion wasn't random, it was precise, threading the solar system like a needle through fabric. Some speculated it was no comet at all, but a probe, its path a deliberate signal encoded in the mathematics of its orbit. The alignment with the ATLAS event, both occurring on the same day, raised eyebrows. Was it coincidence, or was the universe sending a synchronized message? The idea of a cosmic connection wasn't new, but it gained traction as the numbers piled up. The Atlas event's missing energy vector aligned eerily with the Earth-Sun axis, a detail that no standard model process could explain. The comet's trajectory, meanwhile, seemed to maximize opportunities for planetary flybys, as if designed to be noticed. In a universe where rare events are already improbable, two such anomalies occurring simultaneously felt like more than chance. Theorists began to wonder, could the Atlas anomaly and the comet's path be linked, not by physics as we know it, but by something beyond our current understanding? The three-eyed anomaly didn't just shake the scientific community, it sent shockwaves through policy, ethics, and global security. At CERN, the safety board convened an emergency session before dawn, grappling with a question that felt almost existential. What happens when our best models fail? The standard model, a triumph of human ingenuity, had guided physics for decades, but now it was crumbling under the weight of a single event. No collider upgrade before 2035 could probe these energies again, leaving a decade-long blind spot. The world's largest science projects meticulously planned years in advance suddenly seemed too slow to keep up. In Geneva, the UN Subcommittee on Space Law dusted off a draft moratorium on vacuum energy weapons, a document born from theoretical fears now feeling all too real. If energy could vanish into hidden dimensions, as the ATLAS data suggested, every nation with a particle accelerator became a stakeholder in a new kind of race. The draft called for a freeze on weaponizing technology tied to vacuum decay or extra-dimensional energy transfer, an acknowledgement that our ethical frameworks were scrambling to catch up. Military planners, energy ministries, and international watchdogs found themselves staring at a horizon that had shifted overnight. The question wasn't just what we could discover, it was whether we were ready to handle a universe that might be more interconnected and less predictable than anyone had imagined. 
At the heart of this scientific upheaval were the people in the ATLAS control room, ordinary humans thrust into an extraordinary moment. The shift leader, whose quick thinking preserved the event's data, became an unsung hero. Her name whispered in CERN's halls, but absent from headlines. The night crew, bleary-eyed and adrenaline-fueled, worked through the dawn, ruling out every possible error. Across the globe, theorists like Elena Nguyen burned the midnight oil, their whiteboards a testament to the human drive to understand the unknown. These weren't just scientists, they were storytellers, chasing a narrative written in the language of the universe. For the rest of us, the three-eyed anomaly is a reminder that the universe is vast, mysterious, and full of surprises. It's a call to stay curious, to question what we think we know, and to embrace the unknown with wonder rather than fear. The data from Atlas, paired with the comet's eerie path, suggests we're on the cusp of something monumental, a new chapter in our understanding of reality. But it's not just about the science. It's it's about the human spirit, the relentless pursuit of truth, and the courage to face a universe that doesn't always play by our rules. The implications of the three-eyed anomaly stretch far beyond the walls of CERN, reaching into the very fabric of how we perceive reality. Picture a universe where the rules we've painstakingly charted are merely shadows of a larger truth, where particles and forces dance to a rhythm we've only just begun to hear. The Atlas event, with its triple muon signature and missing energy, feels like the first note of that rhythm, a signal that the cosmos is more intricate, more layered, than our models can yet capture. Theorists now wrestle with the possibility possibility that this anomaly isn't an isolated event, but a glimpse into a network of phenomena that could connect particle physics with cosmic mysteries. The alignment of the missing energy vector with the Earth-Sun axis, combined with the comet's improbable trajectory, sparks questions that border on the philosophical. Are we detecting the fingerprints of a universe that communicates across scales, from subatomic collisions to celestial orbits? The idea is dizzying, yet it fuels a fire of curiosity that burns brighter with each unanswered question. The clock is ticking for the global scientific community. With no collider capable of replicating the Atlas event's conditions until 2035, researchers face a daunting challenge. How to probe the unknown with tools that feel suddenly outdated. The anomaly has exposed a gap not just in our understanding, but in our infrastructure. A reminder that discovery often outpaces preparation. Teams at CERN, Fermilab, and beyond are now racing to refine simulations, hoping to extract every ounce of insight from the existing data. Data. But the stakes are higher than ever. If the anomaly points to extra dimensions or a dark sector, the implications could reshape technology, energy, and even our understanding of space-time. The urgency is palpable, as scientists balance the thrill of discovery with the weight of responsibility. What happens if the next clue emerges before we're ready? The three-eyed anomaly has turned the scientific timeline into a sprint, pushing humanity to innovate faster than ever before. This moment belongs not just to physicists, but to all of us who dare to look up at the stars and wonder. The Three-Eyed Anomaly is a story of human ingenuity, of late nights and bold ideas, of a species reaching for truths that lie just beyond our grasp. It's a reminder that science isn't a solitary pursuit, but a global conversation, one that thrives on shared curiosity and collective effort. As we stand on the brink of a potential revolution in physics, you're invited to join the dialogue. We, what does this anomaly mean to you? Could it be a new particle, a hidden dimension, or something we can't yet name? Share your thoughts in the comments, and let's spark a discussion that crosses borders and disciplines. If this story has ignited your sense of wonder, give it a like to keep the momentum alive, and subscribe to follow the unfolding mystery. The universe is calling. Let's answer together. As the dust settles from that fateful night at CERN, the three-eyed anomaly continues to cast a long shadow over the scientific world, its enigma growing more intricate with each passing day. The alignment of the Atlas event with the comet C-2025X3's peculiar orbit has sparked a flurry of interdisciplinary speculation, drawing astronomers, cosmologists, and particle physicists into an unexpected collaboration. Could the anomaly's missing energy, angled so precisely at 36 degrees above the beamline, be linked to a cosmic phenomenon far beyond our planet? Some theorists propose that the event might hint at a transient interaction with a field permeating the cosmos, one that could tie sub 
subatomic particles to the large-scale structure of the universe. The comet's trajectory, with its statistically improbable precision, feels like a cosmic echo, as if the universe is orchestrating a dialogue between its smallest and largest scales. This convergence of particle and celestial anomalies pushes scientists to consider a radical possibility. What if the laws of physics we've built our understanding on are just a local dialect in a much grander cosmic language? The three-eyed anomaly doesn't just challenge our scientific models, it forces us to confront the ethical boundaries of discovery itself. As researchers dig deeper into the implications of extra dimensions or a dark sector, the potential applications of such knowledge loom large. A particle like the dark photon, if confirmed, could unlock new ways to harness energy or manipulate forces, but it also raises questions about control and consequence. The UN's draft moratorium on vacuum energy weapons reflects a growing unease. What happens if we uncover forces we can't contain? Scientists are now navigating a delicate balance, weighing the pursuit of truth against the risks of opening doors that can't be closed. This ethical frontier extends beyond the lab, touching on global cooperation and responsibility. The anomaly has transformed particle accelerators from tools of discovery into potential gateways to uncharted realms, prompting a global conversation about how humanity should proceed when the universe reveals secrets we're not yet equipped to handle. The three-eyed anomaly is more than a scientific milestone. It's a beacon, illuminating the path toward a future where curiosity and collaboration redefine our place in the cosmos. The event has galvanized a new generation of scientists, from graduate students poring over data to veteran researchers revisiting theories once dismissed as fringe. It's a reminder that the universe rewards those who dare to ask bold questions, even when the answers are elusive. For every physicist scribbling equations, there's a dreamer gazing at the stars, wondering what this anomaly means for our understanding of existence. The story of Atlas's July 3rd event is a call to action, urging us to embrace the unknown with open minds and fearless hearts. As we await the next breakthrough, the anomaly stands as a testament to the power of human curiosity, a spark that could ignite a revolution in how we see the universe and ourselves within it. So what does this mean for you watching this story unfold? It's a chance to marvel at the universe's complexity, to feel the thrill of discovery that pulses through every lab and observatory. The three-eyed anomaly isn't just a data point, it's a story, one that invites you to ask questions, seek answers, and share your thoughts. What do you think this event means? Could it be a new particle, a hidden dimension, or something we can't yet imagine? Drop your ideas in the comments below and let's start a conversation that spans the globe. If this story has sparked your curiosity. Give it a like to keep the momentum going and subscribe to stay updated as this mystery unfolds. The universe is speaking. Let's listen together. As of September 1st, 2025, the Atlas Anomaly remains unexplained, a puzzle that continues to captivate physicists worldwide. No collider can replicate the event's conditions until at least 2035, leaving scientists to grapple with simulations and theories in the meantime. The data, with its 7.5 sigma certainty, stands as a beacon, guiding researchers toward possibilities once confined to the edges of journals, supersymmetry, extra dimensions, dark photons, and beyond. The comet C2025X3, with its improbable path, adds another layer of intrigue, hinting at connections we're only beginning to explore. The three-eyed anomaly is more than a scientific milestone. It's a testament to the power of human curiosity. It challenges us to rethink our place in the cosmos, to question the boundaries of what's possible, and to prepare for a future where the rules of reality might be rewritten. For now, the universe holds its secrets close, but with every experiment, every equation, and every shared idea we inch closer to understanding. The story of the three-eyed anomaly is just beginning, and you're part of it.